界のモンスターでオーバーレネットワークを構築エクシーズ将軍Hello everybody and I hope you enjoyed those little replays. So uh, yeah, this is basically the rank 4 toolbox with some 
heroic challenges, some clowns, and some shocks. Nothing really that impressive. The only really thing uh, of somewhat importance are uh, Knuckle Knife, which makes good. Uh, this is good for being a rank 4 enabler, I really like it, it does stuff with all the Assault Hold Birds and the Thousand Blades. Bustle Shark is uh, somewhat of a win condition, uh, because most people, if they see it, they just tend to surrender, since they think they're um, fighting against a Crooked Cook deck, which we're playing one, but I don't really like using it. Uh, we of course have our draw spells with Popper Up, Spellbook of Knowledge, and of course Spellbook Magician of Prophecy, uh, the Hand Traps, Ash Blossom, Draw, and Imperm, and Overlay Network, which is another enabler for the rank 4 plays. Uh, we have Rank Up Magic the 7th one, because we're playing Rebarrigan Shark to get into Utopian Draco Future, because we're playing Water, so we have Bahamut Shark, and our 7th one target is Masquerade. Which gives us some aura masquerade, which can pop a spell or trap, and then negate a monster effect. Which is very decent, since not only does it negate the effect, it also sends a random card from the opponent's hand to the grave and halves their life points. Which is very good. Uh, we're playing Dark Rebellion at Seeds Dragon because we always need a beta, and Dark Rebellion does uh, well go in tandem with Ragnar Zero, which is a combination that's as old as those monsters and I really like it. Next some utility monsters like Malevolent Sea, Sin, Time to Free Dua, Baguska, Tornado Dragon, Abyss Dweller, and the Utopic Future Package. So yeah, that's, uh, that's it for this and I hope I'll see you next time the next video. Check out what's going on. Peace!